When are you gonna get a uh, you know, 1500 gallon tank? When I decide to shrink my 2000 down, maybe I'll go for 1500. <laughs> It's, it puts it into perspective though, doesn't it? When it's Dude, in the air. it does. Like, cause, I don't know, I've never seen your tank so in person. This is about three feet, imagine four feet tall, seven feet front to back, and ten feet long. That's my tank. But when something like this is up in the air, it just seems so much It seems more massive. Yeah, it's huge. Like, if someone had this in their house, it'd be like, cool. Oh. Yeah, man. It's huge. Robert. All right, we're still here. Look, man, the first, the first, uh, what's it called? What? The first step is is realizing you have a problem. It is. My name's Robert. Um, I breed fish, and I... And George killed my... <laughs> no, no. <laughs> we, can't, we gotta edit that one out. <laughs> you need a big tank now, bro? I think you got a big tank. I got, I got a 480, but I want I want something bigger. Oh, cute. 480 is just too small, dude. <laughs> I mean, when people got 800 gallons and 2,000 gallons, like... My viewers want to look at your viewers. Do they? Wow. <laughs> what would they say to each other? Like, probably hot. <laughs> something like that. <laughs> what do you got for fish? What do you got? <laughs> what a shrimp. You got this monster. Look at this huge tank. Holy moly. Dude, this thing's like 16 feet long. Let's see. It is. There's eight feet right there. There's another eight feet. So that means it's 20 feet long. This is a monstrous tank I've ever seen. At least longest. That's actually like owned by someone. Yes, we do. 100%. How crazy is that? Imagine this with all, all shrimp. Like, that's the dream right there. What is going on, Shrimp Keepers? We are at. All right, we are here with Sean's snails. That's the most important part of what he's gonna say. Yeah, and there's a. Also, I want to tell you that we're on Ocean's floor. It's a very large store. In you Arizona. ruined my intro. <laughs> Sorry. Rob, from Sorry. Whoa, 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 whoa. Hey. 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 So we're here with Joey. We got Cool Fizz 12D. The water box. This thing is monstrous. Use. He's the only salt oh, they so use. I'm filming this. I'm filming this. <laughs> what is this? What's this? Sorry, sorry, sorry. Oh, dude, how good does that feel walking in here and seeing your salt? It's good. Isn't it sweet? Yeah, I mean, I've gotten used to it, you know. Yeah. <laughs> That's awesome. Complete store tour with Amanda. That's a pretty background. Some nice discus. Some more discus. Puffers? Compact puffers. Ooh, I like this guy. Pretty, this guy looks grumpy. We're just unhappy, I can't tell. It's crazy. A gourami. I'm pretty sure it's a grommy. It looks like one. What are those? Um, some type of bass. Peacock? Bass, maybe? I don't know. I want to see how much this tank costs. $20,000. My absolute favorite section of the store so far. It's all saltwater fish, but like just how they have like this little setup up here. Um, I don't know if it's all central filtration. It looks like it. And I guess these are like more aggressive, like small fish that can't be kept together, maybe? Oh, look at this little guy! This guy's awesome! That is so stinging cool. I've never seen one in person. I think it's a cowfish, maybe? It doesn't look like one, though. I don't know. There's some really cool eel in there. But like, I love this setup because there's these huge tanks on the bottom. They got like some angels in here. But they have a ton of stuff. And uh, this is my favorite, well, I don't know if this is my favorite part, but I really like this part. It's like natural wood, and then they just put the LEDs up above it. 
And yeah, I mean, it's like real, real simple we made, but it's like, it's very awesome. Like, this is huge. This is so big. So, I'm not a big saltwater guy, but I really like it. Sorry. Sorry, I'm just trying to No, you're good. You got stuff to do. Yeah, meet Steve. He's awesome. Steve's a big boy. I did not see the stingray. Okay. So we got Amanda with us. Amanda, show me the stingray. It's over here. <laughs> it's over here. I love stingrays. That's what I'm up in a second. Really? Why did he for you? Oh yeah. That's why I'm Like how big how big do you think these tanks are? Hundred gallons? Yeah, maybe. And they're pretty big. There's like multiple sections. We got some crazy flow going. Grass. Yeah, Mandy used to out. keep salt water, so she's much, much more well versed than I am. He'll come out in a second. He's pretty though. He's blue. See him hiding right there? Like that's the one underneath front. the rock? That's his front. Is it really? Yeah, he looks really cool. He'll come out in a second. He's camera shy. He's camera shy. He doesn't like being, doesn't like being on YouTube. Yeah, this is awesome. This is my, this is my favorite. I, I need this tank in my life. Oh, I love that. Oh, the, what is the color? Is he orange? Yeah, they're orange and like royal blue. Well, oh, I like this. They don't, they don't have the blue light over it, so the colors actually pick up. This is the guy that we were looking at over there. It's called a flaming one. This guy? Or no, the one that you were talking about? Look how pretty Come on, this blue guy. Oh, he just moved. Dang it. Hurry, hurry. Oh, and he has blue on his tail. Yeah. It's like a purple Beautiful. Yeah. That guy's cool. Well, I'll show you my favorite thing here in a second. I gotta follow Amanda around. See, not the weirdest puffer you've He's ever so seen. cool. That looks like the one Ken has. Shout out to Radical Reefs. You can find him on YouTube and at radicalreefs.com. This guy's really pretty. Is that not the biggest tank ever? It's 20 feet long. 20 feet long, it looks like three feet tall, maybe two feet wide. Like, look at this knife fish. It's huge. Put your hand up there so we can see the, the comparison. It's awesome. All right, let's go see the rest of it. Lucas Brett's uh, rock pile right here. Big RO tower. I think this one's bigger than ours. It is. What do we got here, hon? It's like tons of snails. Yeah, and some goats. Look at all these guys. Guys, I'm, I'm calling it here. I'm setting up a saltwater tank. Because who doesn't want this shrimp right there? Sexy shrimp. Yeah. Are they not the cutest things ever? They're so sweet. Do they breed in salt water? Like, can we get them and breed them? I don't know. They're so cool. They actually remind me of freshwater shrimp. The crystal reds almost? That cool. We're at? What is that? It's a banded shrimp. Did this we is the little watchman goby. Is that the one that pairs up with uh, Most goby pistol shrimp? Most pair up with shrimp. <coughs> we gotta see oh, the we gotta go back here, right, babe? This is all the fresh water? Yeah, way back here. Ooh, what's this? Shimmery tank. I like the shimmery. The Kessel. This is the Kessel. Right? Yeah, that's pretty. Uh, I love, that's why I like Kessel. That's yeah. the only reason. Though. That's <laughs> the only reason. Crabs. Ooh, I like those. Little cute tank with some uh, Siru stone. Uh, hey, hey. Um, these guys right fish tank. So that kind of gives you an idea of, you know, still not, still not even halfway full, bro. They got a lot of hardscape and stuff. It's actually a really nice store. Looks like they got maybe these are 40 gallons. They keep their fish. That kind of gives you an idea. There's another, that one's probably the biggest fish. This one right here. It's a massive store. Large and Petros. Um, 
crazy. Look at all the Otosinkas. Love these guys. One of the best algae eaters out there. Oh, Harlequin Reservoirs. Love these guys. These look really healthy. Massive. Look at these big guys. Bunch of mollies. Yeah, what's your favorite so far? Another monster tank. Iridescent shark, maybe? I think that's what that is. Looks like a bard. I'm not good with fish though. So don't don't quote me on any of these. Hey, Amanda. Hey, come here real quick. These guys are sweet, but they're a pain in the butt to catch. What are they? Loaches. Holy loaches? Have you ever tried to catch them? No. It's terrible. Maybe we should get some for the no, shop. No, it's terrible. They're so fast. <laughs> I like them, though. Do they get big? I don't think so. Like this big. Was there a full grown one? Let me see how big. Oh, okay. And then point. Point at one of the fish. Be like, oh, look at that fish. Yeah, that's my girl. That's my girl. Hey, those are glass cats. You glass ever seen cats? This? Yeah, I've seen them. You're All right, we only have a few minutes. Let's get moving. I want to see everything. Okay. I'm following. I'm following you. I'm looking for specifics. What are you looking for? Scarlet bass. Like that guy. Yeah, some shrimp. Is there shrimp? Ghost shrimp. These guys are always so unhealthy. They actually have a ton of lot. We tried to order in these one time and they just did terrible. Like half of them arrived dead, and then the other half died within like a week. It was really sad. So we don't ever reorder stuff like that just because like there's no point in getting stuff that's just gonna die. This stuff's kind of crazy looking. Looks like almost man-made. Ah, no, it does look man-made. This looks like serious though. I don't know what it is. Malaysian driftwood. Upside down package. You found one? Yeah. Right next to me. It's an upside down. Oh yeah. We need to get a big tank at home. I just miss having a tank. Look at this spider wood. Crazy. Yeah, they have uh, orange needles. Do they? Neo caridine shrimp? They don't like the Why? I don't know. They could just be eating algae. No, they look unhappy. Mm. They have a blue shrimp down there. See him? No, I don't. See him under the plant, right here. Look, see the yellow one hanging off oh, the plant? Oh, and he's right below him. it. It's always cool when I see pestoids carrying shrimp. It's like it wasn't long ago that no one even knew it's shrimp. Mina, what do you think? It's pretty. What? It's pretty. It's pretty? Look how the stuff's growing onto it. I like these guys. And then you can pick I'll get the same thing that I can. You guys doing all right over here? Yeah, we need to get some, some fresh. Yep. This is awesome. Some live raw. We got a uh, Sean Snail spotting. He's, uh, he's got his new camera. He's going to start posting on, uh, on YouTube. There he goes. Hi, right, babe. So, what do we got here? It looks like how big of a tank? Um, 200. 200 gallon? Okay. If you if you go up there and put your hand as high as you can, let's see how big it is. Whoa! <laughs> we need one of these in our living room. We should get one of these for the gallery. I'd like square. How sweet would it be to have a huge cube tank like this? 
Have Joey, Joey make one. I want. That's actually a good idea. Okay. That's a pretty frag thing. So we're here because of Pet Fest. We're on like a, uh, a three hour delay. Um, so like, it's, it's actually three hours ahead of where we are now. So what time is it? It's 9.46 at home. It's 9.46, which means it's 6.46 here. We still have a lot to do. It's been a, uh, it's been a crazy weekend, right babe? So Amanda's been working hard and uh, it's been fun. We came here for Pet Fest and it, there's a ton of creators. That is a cute tank. Just so you guys know, Amanda likes anything small. So, small tanks, small anything, like, she wants it. This is kind of like the system we have. Rob Buck, behind the scenes. Oh, Sean Snips. What you didn't see on his camera? Sean Snips. Sean Snips. <laughs> Come to a theater near you. I already got that shot. I was gonna use it, so I'm oh, sorry. Sorry, I won't use this then. <laughs> Dude, are you really gonna start making videos? I don't know. I think I'm gonna do it. I I can commit to making videos. Yeah? But being good at it, I don't know. Well that's okay. <laughs> you guys, I will promise <laughs> at least less than par content. <laughs> You love let you blue car. Those are cardinal pictures. Those are cardinal pictures. Those are all the way to the tip of their nose. Um, and the red also goes in the stuff that's What else we got here? What else we got, Rob? We got a ton of stuff. Oh, you missed it, Rob. It was the coolest thing ever. Dude, that's the story of my life, man. Did you get it on video for me? No. Wow, you didn't film it? Uh -oh. That's awesome. What is it good for? <laughs> Absolutely. I'm been here it's true. Here. It's true. <laughs> Do you know what type of fish this is? It's a pike. That's a pike? A pernicula. 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 Pernicula? I don't know. Pike or pernicula. I can't remember the... It's a pernicula, I think. What the heck is it called? I don't know. That thing's I don't, awesome. I don't pronounce though. them anything wrong. Right. It looks right. like right. it's a <laughs> I don't know. I don't know. Pernicula. Pernicula. Let us know in the comments. <laughs> <laughs> this is what the comment is doing. Amanda, so since this is your favorite tank, what's your favorite part of it? Mm. If we had to take it to our house, would this be it? No. I just like community tanks. It's pretty different yeah. fish. I actually love, uh, I love cribs. Like one of my favorite tanks ever was a, a crib tank. And it's just such an easy to grow plant. It looks good, it grows in, it melts a lot, but uh, looks good. Oh, they turn on all the lights for us. I've never owned a discus before. Have you? No. Do you know what these are called, babe? Those aren't Remy Nose, are they? Remy Nose Tetra? That's what I was going to guess, but I didn't want to be wrong. So I figured if you said it, I'll be okay. Great, if I'm wrong, then I look like a Remy. Then we're all wrong. Some Rams. We need to do a community tank again. Are you? I already know what I'm putting in it. What are you putting in it so it's everyone knows? Is it a surprise? No, I'm not telling. Okay. Well, that is all we have for uh, this tour of Ocean's Floor, I believe it is. Ocean's Floor in uh, Phoenix, Arizona, or Mesa, Arizona. I'm not really sure. I don't know. We're, is it Phoenix? We're just along for the ride. Um, Joey wanted to come, everyone else wanted to come, so we're like, ah, oh, we'll go. Might as well make a video while we're here at Pet Fest. And so, yeah, great time, great store. They got a ton of stuff. It's like 17,000 square feet. Like, do you have an idea my warehouse is four? So it's, uh, it's much bigger.